When it comes to training to be a professional golfer, there is really no right or wrong way to go. Many golfers have blossomed into world-class players late in their careers, while others are ready for the tour right out of college. In the case of Adam Svensson, all we know is that no matter what he decides to do, it'll probably be right. That's because the 20-year-old is playing near-perfect golf lately and has no indication of slowing down. He's an important member of the national golf team, but doubters may look at his choice of playing Division II NCAA golf as a bad choice for his future in the game. Svensson doesn't look at it that way. He's playing against the golf course and not against other D2 golfers. Me myself, I don't, I don't really play the, uh, I don't really play the players. I play the golf course, so I'm not too worried about what they do. I, all I focus on is uh, beating the golf course. I mean, I see a guy that's eight under um, after the first round. It's like whatever to me. A lot of guys get, oh, he's eight under. I should be. That's what I just kind of think about is as, uh, it's kind of a long race, like a marathon. So over the four days, I think if you just be consistent, I mean, you should have a chance to win. The Surrey BC native is currently the number one ranked Canadian and number 28 in the world amateur rankings. He spent this past year carrying plenty of momentum after winning the Phil Mickelson Award as the Division II most outstanding freshman and has never looked back. Just look at his long list of golf accomplishments. The 2012 Canadian Junior Boys Champion. In 2010, he won the BC Junior, the BC Men's Amateur, the CN FutureLink Pacific Championship, the Callaway Junior World Golf Championship, and the Canadian Juvenile Boys Championship. Just a few weeks ago, Svensson received his second major college golf award, the Jack Nicklaus Award honoring him as the NCAA Division II Player of the Year. Yeah, it just tossed my year off. I mean, I don't think it would have been as stellar a year as it was if I didn't win that, so I'm pretty proud of myself. Playing this well helps explain how we managed to join an elite list of Jack Nicklaus Award winners that includes players such as Tiger Woods, Phil Mickelson, Hunter Mahan, Luke Donald, David Duvall, Bill Haas and Ryan Moore. Canada's Matt Hill and Eugene Wong are the only other two Canadians to receive collegiate golf's highest honour. At the moment, Svensson may be a bit of an unknown given his commitment to a small D2 school in Florida. But Graham Dillette golfed at Boise State and David Hearn at Wyoming. Neither school is known for their golf pedigrees. Svensson's path to professional golf may be similar to the two top Canadian PGA Tour players. So it won't be that hard to believe that one day he may find himself chipping and putting his way onto the world's toughest golf tour.